So, um, my name is David Shichimi. I'm the president of World Youth Parliament, based in Kenya. World Youth Parliament is a world youth organization that involves young people in a world leadership and decision making process, as well as the fight against poverty and ignorance. So um, we involve ourselves in the in conflict issues and bring it to trying to bring a solution between uh, or among conflicted uh, parties. Um, for example, in our World Youth Assembly that we are organizing to launch, we shall have representatives from each and every country. Then we try to bring a collegiality and friendliness among youth from different countries so that we commonize the problem of the world. We make it a common problem to everyone so that we have a common a common approach. When we have a common approach, it enables us to fight the problems as a team. So so that all youth from different countries will be a, a strength, will be a single team. A single team um, contributing to a common way of solving global issues. For the climate change, we would like to have a, a World Youth Summit on climate change in Kenya to come next year. And during that summit, we shall declare, we shall declare the last quarter of the year 2012 to be the World Youth Environmental Quarter. The World Youth Environmental Quarter means that um, each and every young person who supports our mission and our vision shall commit him or herself in planting trees and protecting the environment for the whole part of the year. And we are targeting that in each and every country that we have a membership or that we create a membership, we shall have uh, at least 10,000 young people working on planting of trees and protecting the environment. Do you think that your representative of, of Kenya in the COP15, we're going to do the work, and it's going to do the work communicating with you and your people? Sure, yes. Um, first of all, I say that um, the Prime Minister of Kenya, Rachel Raborela, is um, attending the COP15, and uh, he's a person that is on the front line of rejuvenating uh, the Mau Forest which is the largest catchment area of Kenya. Um, so because of his dedication and his seriousness, his vision and focus, I believe that uh, we shall work with him as young people. Uh, we'll, have a, we'll have with him an appointment in January. So we are going to work with him in making sure that um, the Mau forest is um, conserved, trees are planted, and uh, we mobilize young people to conserve the environment. So I believe that he will be able to bring the message um, to the nation, to the country, and also to the National Assembly.